Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you the Evoc 20 Polysynth that comes with Logic Pro 10. The Evoc 20 Polysynth is a polyphonic synthesizer and vocoder, and in this tutorial, we are going to focus on its application as a vocoder. Vocoder stands for voice encoder. It's responsible for the sort of synthetic vocal sounds or robotic vocal sounds that were made popular in the 80s by bands such as Cardfurk and later Daft Punk. So let's get started. I'm going to set up a software instrument track in Logic. And as my instrument, I'm going to choose the Evoc 20 Vocoder Synth. Okay. So we have that there now. And what I need to do next is create an audio track. track, new audio track. I'm using this audio track to use my actual voice as input. And we're going to use that track as input on the vocoder. And it's going to take the articulations of my voice and use those when I play notes and chords on the polysynth. So the first thing I'm going to do now is record my voice. So I just load the audio track, I make sure that I'm using the right audio interface, so I'll go to Logic, Preferences, Audio, make sure I'm using the right audio interface as input, and then select the correct input for my microphone on the audio track, and there you see the meter going off at my voice. So now I'm just going to record myself saying something. Welcome to the Evoc 20 polyphonic synth in Logic Pro 10. Okay, let's have a listen back to that. Welcome to the Evoc 20 polyphonic synth in Logic Pro 10. Okay, and what I'm going to do now is just loop that. So we have it in a continuous loop. And now I'm going to go to the instrument where my polysynth is located. And in the very top right hand corner of the polysynth, I'm going to use audio one as my input. Audio one being the track that I recorded my voice on. And now I'm going to play back the loop as I play the synth. But first of all, I'm going to switch the signal on the top right hand corner of the synth here to vocoder. If I just leave it on synth, it's literally just the synth playing. Okay. But now I'm going to switch it to vocoder. So it's taken the audio track as input signal. So it's going to take all of the articulations from my voice, vowels, level changes, consonants, etc., and map those to the keys that I play on the synthesizer. So first of all, we actually have to play back the audio. Welcome to the Evoc 20 polyphonic synth in Logic Pro 10. Welcome to the Evoc 20 polyphonic synth in Logic Pro 10. Welcome to the Evoc 20 polyphonic synth in Logic Pro 10. So as you could quite clearly hear, you could hear my voice coming through, but it's like my voice was singing the chord that I was playing. Okay, so that's how we set up the vocoder to use a microphone or our voice as input to make our voice sing the notes that we're playing. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.